Hello, Jester Good here, and I've had these five packs of Lego Harry Potter CMFs just sitting around for like a month or two now. Don't remember which ones they are. I'm sure one of them is a Percival Graves. Let's open these bad boys. All right, number one. Let's see who's inside. And, oh, Luna Lovegood. So here is Luna Lovegood, and she has a two by three of the printed Quibbler magazine. Love that new hair piece. I'm glad I got another one of her. I actually felt this one specifically up because I need another Luna. I think I only have two, so three would be great for that hair piece. Also, she has her wands, which I'm not gonna take those out because those can get lost very easily once they're removed. All right, the next pack. Oh shoot, did I cut into something? That's not good. Oh, there is Harry in his pajamas. This was another one I specifically felt for because I only had two of him. I like getting at least three of each figure in the series, especially one I like like this one. Also, here's his invisibility cloak, which is a great little accessory, and he also has his wand. All right, next pack. Let's see what's going on here. It is... Oh, what is it? It's not Tina, but... Weenie Goldstein, that's it. And she has a new strudel piece, which I really like. Also, her assess or sorry, her torso and legs are very well done. I, I love the printing on there. I think it looks fantastic. That's it for Queenie Goldstein. All right, next pack, and it is oh, there he is, Percival Graves. Which the design for this is uh, not one of my favorites of the series, but he is rare. Like I said, I want to get three of each figure in the series, and this is my third one, from my understanding. And of course he is Grindelwald at the back, which he comes with that extra hair piece. Somewhere around here, let me see, are his wands, which you can see are black. All right, last pack, let's see what's inside. Okay, let's see. Okay, I kind of feel bad. I did not mean to buy two of these, I swear. Okay, I think I got one of these from Mars Noble and I got one of these from Walmart. And I don't think I planned to get, like, you know, I, I must have forgot I got the other one. I don't know. Either way, now I have four of this figure. And I'm officially done with this series because I did not need four of this particular figure. But I guess he is rare, so that's kind of neat. I thought he actually had the black ones, but I guess that was Tina's. Huh. Uh, but this is, of course, Grindelwald and Percival Graves. The rarest of the series because there's only one per box, so I kind of feel bad getting four of them. Well... Uh, the next time I'll buy this series is probably when I get every minifigure ever whenever I do those openings. But for now, here are all the minifigures here. And yeah, pretty good loadout, or really good loadout, because you got two of the rare ones, also two other rare ones, and another uh, Queenie is always nice as well. So that's it for now. Hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I'll see you guys later. Peace out.